Hello and welcome to Flexibility Learning Channel. In this video we will learn what are software requirements. We will also learn what are user and system requirements. So let's get started. First of all we will see what are software requirements. Software requirements refer to the specifications and descriptions of what a software system or application needs to accomplish. Software requirements engineering is a crucial phase in the software development life cycle where the goals, functionalities, constraints, and quality attributes of the software are defined. Without fulfilling any system requirements, no system can work properly. Now we will see what are user requirements. User requirements are descriptions of what end users expect from the software. They capture the needs, preferences, and workflows of the software's intended users. User requirements help ensure that the software meets the usability and functionality needs of its target audience. Basically user requirements are the requirements of user who will use the system. For example, suppose you are a web developer and user asks you to create a website of his company. For that he has to give some requirements which he wants from this website. In other words the functions which user want from his website are the user requirements. So user requirements are those which user want from the system. Needs of users are called user requirements. Now we will see what are system requirements. A system requirement is a specific and detailed description of what a software application or technical system needs to do, how it should behave. These requirements outline the functionalities, behaviors, and technical specifications that the system must adhere to, guiding its design, development, and testing processes. System requirements ensure that the resulting software or system works as intended and fulfills its intended purpose. They help ensure that the software can function within the desired technical environment. Basically these requirements are the actual functions of system. For example, if we're talking about a game that you play on your computer or phone, a system requirement could be something like this. The game needs to be able to run smoothly on computers with at least 4GB of RAM and a graphics card that supports DirectX 11. This was all about system requirements. I hope after watching this video, now you know what is our software requirements and also the difference between user and system requirements. Thanks for watching this video. If this video was helpful, do like and subscribe this channel for future learnings.